Let's check out how we use our mobile shear to process steel. And today we're cutting up this old long backhoe. You can see he's trying to bite between the hydraulic cylinder and the arm. That way he can get through just the arm piece a little easier without having to go through the cylinder. cylinders still do have to be cut before they can go to the steel mill or else that is a possible issue in the furnace but cylinders can be tough on the shear head if they're really big we'll torch them or if we can we'll just cut through the barrel part of it which is the part that's most concerning working his way up the cylinder until he was basically in the barrel where the rod was not present and then it cut right through it. But you can see it's not the fastest machine in the world. He basically just keeps whittling away at it until he gets it all cut up and he gets stuff like those tires cut off there and then anything that's too thick for him to cut with the shear we'll bring over here and put in the torch pile and then we'll spread it out on this pad and cut it up with a torch.